Well, Apple claims it fixed a bug that left, left hackers or that let hackers access iCloud accounts. The bug has spread nude pictures of celebrities across the internet. Apple's Find My Phone software was vulnerable to so-called brute force attacks in which hackers try multiple passwords to get access. Actress Jennifer Lawrence was among those whose private photos were made public. The FBI is investigating. Now, if it can happen to celebrities, then what about your pictures? Apple's iCloud backs up photos and other personal information automatically. News Channel 8's Lindsay Mastis shows you what you can do to protect your data. Just like celebrities, Apple users are storing pictures and personal information on iCloud. And a lot of people don't even know about it. Do you know if you even use iCloud? At this point, I'm not even sure. Everything from contacts and calendars to pictures and web favorites can be backed up and possibly accessible to hackers. Anybody can get hacked. In fact, most people have been hacked. They just don't know it. Sri Sridharan with the Florida Center for Cybersecurity at the University of South Florida points to this map showing real-time hacking attempts from around the world. He says the best defense is a strong password. If those passwords are something that people can easily guess, you're asking for trouble. Users can also limit what data is stored to the cloud. There is a way to turn off iCloud completely. Here's how you do it on an iPhone. Just go to settings, tap on iCloud, scroll to the bottom, tap on storage and backup, and then click iCloud backup to turn it off. The whole reason for having iCloud is so users can access data even if computers fry or cell phones go missing. If you lose something and it, it's there, like you don't actually lose it. And it may be a concern to some people, but I believe that my stuff is protected. So it's worth the risk. It's, risk, it's worth the risk, apparently. I think so. Bottom line, if you don't want anyone to see anything that might be sensitive, don't store it on iCloud, don't put it on a computer. It's not always possible, but the only way you can guarantee that hackers can't get to it is if it's in a place that hackers just can't get to. In Tampa, I'm Lindsay Mastis, News Channel 8. In addition to having strong passwords, Free to Run recommends using difficult security questions. Hackers may have gained access to celebrities' accounts by answering some of those questions correctly.